How's it going guys, this is Twister and today I am finally bringing you guys some Black Ops 2 gameplay. Um, this is some ground war domination I do believe on the map Turbine. Um, I'm using the MSMC with I think I've just got the laser attachment um, in this gameplay, I'm not too sure. And the score streaks, ow, I just banged my elbow. And the score streaks that I'm rocking out um, in this gameplay I think is the Hunter Killer Drone, the Guardian and the Lightning Strike. For low kill streaks, um, them three are very good so I definitely recommend them. But um, the one thing you guys might be wondering is, is like where have you been like Black Ops 2? Has, um, it's been out for a few days now and I haven't even uploaded that and the reason for that is I didn't really want to upload um, well I, I actually did want to get videos out but I just didn't want to upload yet because like the first impressions of this game were pretty much that I didn't really like it um, the first game that I hopped on um, well the first couple games on Newtown I was really enjoying it but that's probably because it was just like a new game that I'd never played before but after that I kind of were able to realise some of the flaws in this game and I just don't think I've managed to get to grips with it yet um, since then my opinion has changed a little um, I have kind of like um, got to know the game better so that's kind of like why I didn't want to um, get a video out the first day because my opinions will just be like negative and negative but you guys don't want to hear that but um, the game has kind of grown on me. I've been playing zombies um, a bit. That is really fun. I really do love zombies. But the multiplayer hasn't really stood out to me. It's good, but it just really isn't outstanding. Now, I'm going to tell you a bit about why I think that. And the main reason is there's such an imbalance between attachments and perks. There isn't really any really good perks that are necessary. But all the attachments pretty much are really, really good. And you can only use three, so it means sacrificing some really, really good ones. And one of the big things is that there's no sleight of hand. Now, I really don't like having to use fast mags. One, it's not the same. It's I, I don't think it is as quick as sleight of hand. And two, it means I have to kind of like waste an attachment on it. Because like the really good attachments are like extending mags, red dot on some weapons, select fire. Um, adjustable stock which is pretty much like stalker um, you've even got stuff like FMJ I think I might have said extending mags um, grip quick draw and it's like I want to be able to use all these guns to like play good because some of them are really good we've got used to like having quick draw and sleight of hand but because they're attachments we can't use them and another downside is you can't use um, fast mags with extending mags which is really rubbish in my opinion so it really feels like if I'm not using fast mags I can't rush around into the spawn because you get like one to two kills before you have to find a safe spot to reload and it really does um, slow down the pace of the game greatly in my opinion so that is one of the main things I do feel that sleight of hand definitely needs to come back and I, I can even do with quick draw coming back so I can use that as a perk and not an attachment um, stalker may as well come back because I haven't really got round to using adjustable stock but I really liked stalker from MW3 so I want to use it but there's just other attachments that I also want to use and also another thing is the maps in my opinion are garbage um, the only half decent map is um, hijacked and that's the only one I can see myself voting but there's a lot of head glitch spots there really is a lot of head glitch spots but um, I'm having a bit of fun um, earlier I managed to unlock this MSMC gun um, that you can see me using in the gameplay it's really good to be honest so I definitely recommend you use that but that kind of like my first opinions I know it was slightly more ne negative than I hope but a really really positive is that the kill streaks are great and um, there are a lot of them and um, there's a wide variety that you can use and they're all really good not just a load of crap and um, the pick 10 system crate class is also really good and weapons are pretty balanced which is pretty decent and um, yeah the pick 10 class is really really awesome it's like you can't really have two people running the same exact exact class setup because you just cater it towards your playstyle now I'm trying to adjust my playstyle as best as I can to be successful at this game but that's like one of the things as well I haven't really been able to be greatly successful at this game um, I don't want to put it down to KD much but I had a 2 KD in MW3 and I can 
barely go positive, uh, but lately I've been doing a bit better. So hopefully I can um, get better on this game, get to know the maps, get to know the game better, and hopefully we should be sorting and I should be bringing you some awesome gameplay soon. And that's really what I want to do. I want to get better and bring the best gameplays out on YouTube, and that's really what I'll keep doing that. So hopefully you guys have enjoyed this video, and hopefully I can see you in my next one. Um, if you want to like the video, definitely do so and subscribe to see more content from me. I'll see you guys later. Peace.